An Anderson Ballet Group is worried that Christmas season performances of The Nutcracker are in jeopardy. Costumes for that production were recently burned in a fire. And even though they were insured, there is doubt that the insurance money will come through in time to remake the costumes. Derek Thomas has more on why time is of the essence. This is video of last year's production of The Nutcracker. Imagine if these costumes were not a part of the production. $52,000 worth of costumes were burned in this fire last month at Vogue Cleaners in Muncie. The costumes were being stored there. We also lost the iconic Nutcracker jacket, uh, the jacket that our Nutcracker wears. While the drama about burned costume swirls, the ballet dancers still work to improve their craft. Over 120 children participate in the holiday production. We like to entertain, so that's, that's our main goal. And it makes us, we just feel good to know that we can make others feel good too. Those are much better guys. 84-year-old Lou Ann Young founded the ballet company 40 years ago and says the show must go on. I just pray that we get uh, money in so we can at least make the costumes that we're so missing. But what if the money is not raised to make the show happen? There would be thousands of people that come to see the show annually as part of their Christmas traditions that would miss it terribly this year. The children feel the same way. To be able to make new costumes and to keep this place running, I think it's a great benefit for our community. This year's shows are scheduled for December 18th through the 21st here at the Paramount Theater. Fingers are crossed that the costumes will be ready. In Anderson, Derek Thomas, RTV6.